بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ہے گائز ویلکم بیک ٹو مائی چینل دٹ از اسٹیل اے لرنر سو ٹوڈے ان دس ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس فورتھ کلاس ای وی ایس ففتھ چیپٹر ورک بک آنسرس اوکے سو اب ٹائٹل از ای ٹوگیدر اوکے ان دا فرسٹ وی ہیو گیون گلوسری وچ مینس میننگس اور سینونیمس اوکے جسٹ گو تھرو ایچ اینڈ ایوری میننگ یو ہیو ٹو ریمبر دیٹ اوکے If you don't understand the meaning of that particular word, you can go through that Telugu in the bracket, okay? Now we'll move to the first worksheet, which is, here the concept is, let's eat together. Okay, here in the first Roman, we have given some words, which we need to rewrite again by writing the first letter as capital. Okay, let's see each word. First one is marriage. Second word, vegetarian. third one relatives fourth one habits fifth one occasions sixth one energy seventh sick eighth one assembly ninth one together and last one is breakfast okay guys these are the 10 words which you need to rewrite again okay now we'll move to the second roman which is list some food items that you would like to share with your friends okay here we need to share the food items which we like to share with our friends so first one is of course biscuits then chocolates then snacks then curry then curd and last one is fruits okay let's see the third roman which is write some occasions where we eat together okay here you need to write down the places where eat together with your friends or family members or anyone okay so first place is marriage of course then picnics then midday like midday meals then fourth one fourth place is parties fifth place is annadanam then sixth place is festivals during festivals okay let's see the fourth question which is what will happen if you had no breakfast answer if we had no breakfast we feel hungry by the afternoon we felt hungry by the afternoon we felt weak we may get sick okay guys now we'll move to the second worksheet which is midday meal okay here the concept is midday meal okay in the first roman we have given some words from this concept which we need to rewrite again by writing the first letter as capital okay let's see each word so first word is midday meal second one lunch third one chikki fourth one lemon rice fifth one pickle sixth one chips seventh one friendship eighth one waste ninth one practice tenth one poverty eleventh one stomach twelfth one nutritious okay guys these are the 12 words from this concept which is midday meal let's see the question which is do you like to take midday meals in your school why answer yes i like to eat a midday meal in my school because it is a healthy and nutritious food i like to eat together with my friends okay i think you also like it okay guys now we'll move to the third roman which is you have a menu chart for mdm which means midday meal in your school if you are asked to prepare a menu chart in your home or hotel what would be the menu okay you may write it down of course your all favorite dishes like monday so and so tuesday so and so like that okay you all just cover your menu with all your favorite dishes isn't it okay let's see here so sunday rice chicken egg curd monday rice curd vegetable curry chutney tuesday rice boiled egg sambar dal wednesday fried rice korma curd sweet pongal thursday rice boiled egg vegetable curry curd friday rice dal curd pulihora and saturday is fish curry rice rasam and curd okay guys now we'll see the fourth roman which is write some food items that keeps you healthy okay here we need to write down the food 
विच कीप्स अस हेल्दी ओके फॉर एग्जाम्पल मिल्क एग्स फ्रूट्स फिश एंड मीट देन वेजिटेबल्स देन सीरियल्स ओके गाइज दीज ऑर द फूड आइटम्स दैट ऑफ कोर्स कीप्स अस हेल्दी ओके स्टे फिट ऑलवेज नाउ विल सी द थर्ड वर्कशीट हियर द कॉन्सेप्ट इज वेस्टेज ऑफ फूड ओके ऑफ कोर्स इन द फर्स्ट रोम वन वी हैव गिवन सम वर्ड्स फ्रॉम दिस कॉन्सेप्ट विच इज वेस्टेज ऑफ फूड ओके दिस वर्ड्स वी नीड टू राइट री री राइट अगेन बाई राइटिंग द फर्स्ट लेट एज कैप्टर ओके लेट सी द वर्ड्स फर्स्ट वर्ड इज फंक्शन सेकेंड वन कुकड थर्ड वन लेफ्ट ओवर फोर्थ वन थ्रोन अवे फिफ्थ वन स्पिल सिक्स वन प्लेट सेवेंथ बॉल एथ स्पून नाइन्थ अनसेफ टेंथ एक्सेस इलेवेंथ ड्रिंक एंड ट्वेल्थ वन इज सर्व ओके गाइज नव विल मूव टू द सेकेंड रोमन विच इज राइट अकेशन वेर फूड इज वेस्टेड ओके हियर यू नीड टू राइट डाउन द प्लेसेस मीन्स अकेशन वेर फूड इज वेस्टेड अ लॉट सो फर्स्ट वन इज ऑफकोर्स मैरिजेस ओके देन बर्थडे पार्टीज देन एट एम डी एम इन स्कूल मीन्स मिड डे मील्स ओके देन फंक्शंस एंड लास्ट वन इज होटल्स ओके Now we'll see the third question, which is here a slightly mistake is there in the question. In the place of C, you have to write the give. Okay, let's see the question. Write the places where you can give the excess food as leftovers. So answer is we can give the excess food as leftover to first one old age homes, second one orphan homes, third one needy people. Fourth one, beggars. Okay, here in these four places, you can give the excess food as leftovers. In this way, you the food will not be wasted. Okay, now we'll move to the next worksheet. That is worksheet number four. Here the concept is say no to plastic. Okay, so from this concept, we have given eight words which we re need to rewrite again, and at the same time, you have to uh, by heart the spelling. Okay, you have to learn the spelling also. Okay, let's see. First one is plastic. Second one, particle. Third one, ill health. Fourth one, discard. Fifth one, pollute. Sixth one, spoiled. Seventh, metal plates. Eighth one is wedding. Now we'll see the second Roman, which is if you are not allowed to use plastic, what would you use to bring these items? Okay, so first item is rice. To carry rice, we use gunny bags. To carry fruits or vegetables, we use cloth bag. To carry milk, we can use metal can. To carry water, we can use metal container. And to carry meat or chicken, we can. Use cloth bag. Okay, in this way we can say no to plats plastic. Okay, guys, now we'll move to the third Roman, which is fill in the basket here, not the blanks. Fill in the basket with the food items you like most. First one, biscuits. Then fruits. Then chocolates. Then ice cream. Then jam. Then milk. Then sweets. Then biryani, my favorite. Then dosa, and last one is chicken. Okay, guys. Now we'll see the fourth one, which is here. Fill in the blanks is given, and some words are also given in a hint box. You can use those words in the appropriate blank. Okay. So first one is there is wastage of dash at wedding places. Of course, food. Second one, we get food from dash farmers. Okay. Then third one, the scheme to provide nutritious food to all children at school is midday meal. Okay, MDM. Then fourth one, eating stale or spoiled food causes sickness. Last one, do not preserve cooked food for a dash for a long time. Okay, guys, this is the answer. Okay, now we'll move to the next worksheet. That is worksheet number five. Here the concept is. Preservation of food. Okay, from this concept, we are given some words which we need to rewrite, and we have to learn that spelling also. Okay, for so first one is preservation, second one jam, third one pickle, fourth one refrigerator, fifth one environment, sixth one junk food, seventh one honey, 
ఎయిత్ వన్ ఫ్రయమ్స్ నైన్త్ వన్ ఫ్రీజింగ్ అండ్ టెన్త్ వన్ ఈస్ కూలింగ్ ఓకే దీస్ ఆర్ ద టెన్ వర్డ్స్ ఫ్రమ్ దిస్ కాన్సెప్ట్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు లర్న్ ద స్పెల్లింగ్స్ ఆల్సో గైస్ అట్ ది సేమ్ టైమ్ ఓకే సో నౌ విల్ మూవ్ టు ద నెక్స్ట్ రోమన్ దట్ ఈస్ రోమన్ నెంబర్ టూ which is identify the raw food and preserved food in the pictures given below write their names in the space provided below them here some food items are given in the picturized form okay and we have given one table in which we have two columns two columns okay so first column is raw food items second column preserved food items okay we need to pick out the correct Uh, food items and write it down under the correct side heading under the correct heading okay so let's see raw food items are vegetables fruits leafy vegetables okay then preserved food items are pickles then jam then frozen fish okay guys if you don't understand please pause the video and write it down okay now we'll see the third roman which is choose the correct answers okay here let's see this so first one is place a dash over cooked food answer is c lid place a lid over cooked food second one we use a dash to store fruits and vegetables answer is b refrigerators in refrigerators we use refrigerators are used to store fruits and vegetables let's see third one which is the material that pollutes environment is dash plastic bags a then th- fourth one take the junk food here the answer is b chips okay next fifth one is what materials are used in pickles for preserving so answer is a salt and oil okay so c b a b a okay now we'll see the fourth roman which is given below are certain items circle the one we do not use to preserve food okay here some means six items are given in which we have to circle those items which we cannot preserve it okay so first one is chili powder and second one is water okay now we'll move to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 6 here the concept is fill to plate okay so from this concept we have given some words which we need to rewrite again okay please make sure you have to write it down you have to start the word with capital letter okay let's see each word so first one is farmer second one carpenter third one miller fourth one is vendor fifth one people sixth one is cultivation seventh word is container eighth word prepare Ninth one, aluminium. Tenth one, sickle. Eleventh, previous, sorry, precious. Twelfth one, artisans. Thirteenth one, appreciate. Okay, guys, these are the thirteen words from this concept. Now we'll move to the second Roman, which is match the following words. Okay, so, so first one is farmer, which is C, grow the crops. second one blacksmith which is d makes the agricultural tools third one miller answer is e which is sell the grains next vendor b converts paddy into rice in a mill then fifth one is people answer is a which is buy and eat food okay let's see the third roman which is write answers in one word means one word answers are given let's see this so first one is who cultivates our food crops answer is farmer okay so second one where do farmers sell their crops answer is they sell their crops in a market third one what do you do with a leftover food in your house answer is we just give it to the needy people okay so fourth one where do you store rice in your house answer is in steel container or else you can write we can store the rice in a refrigerator also okay let's see fifth one whom do you want to share your food answer is with my friends okay guys let's see the next roman which is roman number 4 so question is write the recipe of preparing bengal gram powder okay so answer is in four points just write it down each point so first point is 
टेक सम रेड ग्राम एंड हीट डेम ऑन अ लो फ्लेम सेकेंड पॉइंट टेक सम रेड चिल्लीस कुमिन सीड्स एंड फ्राई देम ऑन ए लो फ्लेम थर्ड पॉइंट नाउ टेक द अब इनग्रीडियंट्स इन अ मिक्सी जार विथ सम सॉल्ट एंड ग्राइंड देम टू मेक अ फाइन पाउडर सो फोर्थ पॉइंट इज अवर रेड ग्राम पाउडर इज रेडी ओके गाइज सो दिज और दिस इज द आंसर फॉर दिस नाउ विल मूव टू द नेक्स्ट वर्कशीट दैट इज वर्कशीट नंबर सेवन Okay, let's see this. Here, some question and answers are given. Let's see each. So, first question is: Name some occasions where people eat food together. Answer: In marriages, in picnics, in functions, students in midday meals, in annadana satrams, people eat food together. Let's see the second question, which is: When does the food get wasted at home? Answer. first point if food is cooked in excess then it gets wasted second point some people spill food while eating third point some people leave out food in a plate fourth point some parents serve much food for the children but children do not eat it completely in this way we waste the food in our home okay guys now we'll see the third question which is mention the people whose efforts are behind the process of producing the food we eat answer so first one is farmers second one agriculturalist third one agriculture laborers fourth one blacksmith fifth one carpenter sixth one miller and seventh one is vendors etc Okay, these are the people whose efforts are behind the process of producing the food we eat. Okay, guys, they they know how much effort it takes to make a food means to make a green. Okay, so let's see the fourth question, which is what questions would you ask a farmer about how they can keep food grains safe from rats, mice, and insects? Answer first point. What do you do to protect your food grains from rats? Second one I means second point. What do you do to protect your food grains from insects? Third point. Which method do you follow to save storage of food grains? Okay, guys, please stop the video and write it down without any mistakes. Now we'll see the fifth question, which is observe the list of vegetables used at the midday meals for a week. and write them in your notebook okay so answer is the following vegetables are used at the midday meals today which is a wednesday so carrot beans potato capsicum and green chilies okay let's see the sixth question which is list out the food items that you preserve at your home for a long period answer the following food items are preserved for a long period first one frames so in telugu we can say orugulu or vadiyalu okay then second one pickles then third one jam and fourth one is meat okay these are the four items which we can preserve for a long period okay some other items are also there but we have picked only four items that's why i have written etc here okay guys now we'll see the seventh question which is make a tree diagram of vegetarian and non vegetarian food and healthy and junk food okay guys so here we need to draw a tree diagram for vegetarian non vegetarian food and healthy and junk food okay here you go for the answer please pause the video and write it down without any mistakes okay now we'll see the eighth question which is you notice kavya feeding the birds with some greens every day how would you appreciate her act answer first point kavya kavya is doing a good job second point many birds are dying because of no food third point kavya saves the birds by feeding them with grains fourth point you can feed food and water to animals and birds and save them Okay, guys. Up to here, your fifth chapter workbook answers is finished. Now we'll cover the assessment five. 
answers also okay let's see that so in the first roman we have given choose the correct answers so first one is the material that pollutes environment is a plastic bags second one who cultivates our food crop answer is b farmer third one what material are used in pickles for preserving answer is a which is salt and oil now we'll see the second roman which is fill in the blanks so first one is there is wastage of dash at wedding place food second one eating stale or spoiled food causes sickness third one give one example of a raw food we eat fruits okay so third roman is match the following let's see this so honey preservative food former then jam fruits okay so correct options are b c and e now we'll see the fourth roman which is draw and color draw eco friendly bags okay which are uh, gunny bags cloth bags that one okay you have to draw those bags here this is a student activity guys you have to do it by yourself okay so now we'll see the last roman that is roman number five here this roman number five is question and answers so first question is write some preserved food items answer pickles jams frames which means orugalu vadiyalu okay so second question what do you do with the leftover food in your house answer we give the leftover food to the needy people or else we feed the leftover food to animals also okay in this way our food is not wasted okay guys up to here you your workbook answers are finished means fifth chapter workbook answers are finished okay i hope this video is very helpful for you if it is helpful guys please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe please do share thank you so much